Wow, it's episode 50 of Code Guess. Kind of blowing my mind. I always feel this way when I reach the end of a series. So Lelouch is face to face with Nunnally. And Lelouch is like, Ugh, should I use the guess on Nunnally? That's just... That just seems weird. Meanwhile, with the fight between Suzaku and Colin, Suzaku's like, there's something me and Lelouch have to do. And Colin's like, ah, do you really crave power that much? It's all just a big misunderstanding. Oh, Anya and Jeremiah are fighting. But forget about that, we're going to Toto and getting some closure on his storyline. He's so injured. Oh, <laughs> no, no, we're back with Lelouch and Nunnally now. It seems like everyone fighting each other has concurring ideas. That's why it's so tragic that they're all fighting each other. Back with Toto, he's trying to go back into the battle, but his lady friend is like, no! She has a name, but I just can't remember it. And Shinkei is fighting too, and he's bleeding from the mouth, because he's so sick. Aw, and Tamaki too. Cece's alive, everyone's just watching. Or fighting. Then Lelouch uses the gas on Nunnally, and he's like, give me the key that shoots off the flayas to the Damocles, etc. And she's like, no, I don't want to do it, but I'm being commanded to do it. And then she's finally like, okay, here you go. Okay, so Jeremiah, I think, no, he's still alive, just kidding. <laughs> Jeremiah, so funny. Jeremiah kind of had a moment with Anya. Colin and Suzaku are fighting, and Suzaku's like, Colin, you're so strong! And Colin's like, oh my god, Suzaku, you're so strong! Oh, and they both think that neither of them can win. Whoa! Did Suzaku die? Oh, didn't see that coming. His stomach kind of hurts. Back with Lelouch and Nunnally. Nunnally wakes up from the gas, and she's like, oh no, you used your gas on me, no! And Lelouch is like, I just have to go down the stairs, and I've escaped you, because you're in a wheelchair. Aww. Oh, she hates him. This is so painful for his heart. Kaguya has found Cece. But that doesn't matter, because Lelouch now has the key to Democles, and he's like, hello everyone, it's me again. He has the Flayas, and he has Democles, and he's just gonna kick your ass. And everyone's like, oh no, what do we do now? And now... He has control over the world, I guess. Two months later, whoa! Whoa, these time jumps. Wow, there's so many people being executed right now. I'm gonna go back and look at that again. Okay, so we got Toto, Colin, Cannon, that random guy I've never mentioned who served Schneisel. Gino, Chinese Empress, Shinkei is still alive. Kaguya, blue haired guy. I don't know who that is. Some person with blue hair. Uh, Tamaki, Ogi, Toto's lady friend, Anya, and Schneisel. <gasps> and Nunnally! <gasps> Twist! Rivals is watching and he's like, I was so pointless! Why was I introduced in the first episode? Nina, Lloyd, Sayaku, Rakshad, um, Lloyd's friend, everyone's in prison. Cornelia, Valletta, and Guilford are looking out the window, and Valletta is so stressed out because Ogi is the father of her bastard child. Holy crap. Ho! Ho! Oh. Zero. Uh. Suddenly, zero. You know who it is? It's Suzaku. It's. It's. It's Suzaku. Suzaku didn't really die. They wouldn't kill. Suzaku is dressed up as zero, but no one knows. Not even Jeremiah knows. <gasps> this is what it is. I know what it is. <gasps> oh yeah, and here it is explaining it. Ah! So, oh my god, Lelouch intentionally made the entire world hate him. And then if someone kills him, then they'll break the chain of hatred. So, you, Suzaku, you have to dress up as zero and then you have to kill me. <laughs> Suzaku is kind of like, uh, I'm not in love with this idea. And that's the Zero Requiem. See, I knew the Zero Requiem was going to involve Lelouch being killed, but I didn't know how it was going to work. And I see in this convoluted way how it will work. This was his plan from the very beginning to be killed. Like, Jesus. The thing is, Suzaku can't be Suzaku anymore because he's dead, technically. So he has to go on being the masked knight of justice. Somehow Nunnally knows all of this. Somehow. And she says I love you to him just before he dies so he can die happy. 
So Cornel Cornelia comes out and she's like, oh, he's dead. So uh, free the, the prisoners. And under the zero mask, Suzaku is weeping. Now we're getting pictures, just like at the end of Full Metal Alchemist Colin Brotherhood. Oh, you know, Colin's going through her life. The world's better now. Oh, Ogi is like making negotiations with Nunnally and Zero, who is really Suzaku. Valletta is so pregnant! Hello! Whoa, and Ogi and Valletta got married! They have a wedding picture! Oh, wait, no, I want to see it again! Oh, everyone went to this wedding. Even Guilford and Cornelia went to this wedding. Oh no, you look like an idiot. Where's Shinkei? I see the Chinese Empress, but I don't see Shinkei. Anyway, Anya's working on an orange farm. <laughs> Jeremiah! Oh my god. <laughs> useless character. And Democles ascended into, the sp into space and exploded. And Cece is wandering the end. I don't know. I mean, there were definitely parts of that episode that made me like really excited and really pumped and happy that they came to certain conclusions. But I... Ugh, there were some aspects of the show that I don't think were done right. There's no way I can get into it right now. I'll be doing a series review of Code Geass very soon. I'm still wondering about Shinkei. Did I miss him blowing up or something? Did he die? I don't remember him dying. <laughs> Maybe he died and I didn't notice. Whatever. So I'll see you next time for the series review, I guess. Bye!